Hi, and good day. Uh, some things that have been interesting down here on the CME Group floors is uh, what's been happening in the commodity markets. We're taking a look at those a lot as of late because a lot of times they can be the canary in the coal mine. They can give us a picture of what might be happening out there. We're not quite seeing that clearly looking at some other products. And I love the commodities for that because, boy, oh boy, it's like the big eye in the sky that doesn't lie. They kind of give us the true story right away. So let's talk about these corn for a second. These corn, going back, say, for a year, has had about a 60 cent range. And in the last few trading sessions, we've clawed half of that back, right? So I would say after the planting report that we got uh, last Friday, that's kind of moved us into a, a bullish more mindset than we had before, right? The funds had been short, they had been pressing the market, uh, but now coming off of what we thought was going to be a bad planting number, it was worse than expected. And if you take it against the five-year average, we were at 30%. The five-year average is something like 65, 66%. Boy, that doesn't look too good, does it? So we've changed the mindset a little bit over there. You do have the funds kind of trying to cannibalize themselves on the way out, hence retracing half of that 60 cent range to get to where we are right now, around 396 and a half ish. Well, that, the problem with that is that puts us in the middle of the range again, right? And that's going to give some folks a little bit of uh, a difficult time about what are we, are we going to go higher? Are we going to go lower? Where are we at? We have to make, for the, make sure that the trend is our friend. And that's what I want everybody to kind of keep an eye on. We've seen that decent move back. It's going to be critical from this point right now because that will be your trend about where this market's gonna take us. And if we can continue to post on gains and then make a run towards that $4 mark, that's gonna be the next line or less next uh, resistance on the way up. So you have to kind of be ready if you are a, a, a hedger to get rid of some of your risk up on those upper levels if we continue to get that move. And if we do trade lower, you have to be ready as a as a user of the market to start to buy some protection in case we have another rally. So we're right in the middle where both sides need to be looking at what this trend is going to do over the next few days or maybe a week to kind of give us a clue what the, the summer might bring to us. It's all going to right now going to be worrying we're worrying about weather, but that's going to be what drives us and that's what's driven us for a long time. Keep an eye on that because we're right in the middle. It's going to be critical over these next few days. So that's it from me. Keep an eye on that decent corn. We'll see what we're going to get for the rest of the week. I'm Scott Shelley.